green hydrogen is becoming an increasingly important topic in the world of alternative energy. In this video, we will discuss the electrolysis of water to produce green hydrogen. We will also explore some of the benefits of using green hydrogen as a source of energy. Electrolysis is a process that uses an electric current to produce green hydrogen gas. In this process, water is split into its component electrons and protons. The green hydrogen gas that is produced can be used as a fuel for various purposes. There are many benefits to using green hydrogen as a source of energy. First, green hydrogen is a clean burning fuel, meaning that it produces very little pollution when burned. Additionally, green hydrogen is renewable and sustainable, making it an environmentally friendly option for energy production. Finally, green hydrogen is very versatile and can be used in a variety of applications, such as powering vehicles or generating electricity. To get started, hydrogen electrolysis requires a water source, an electrolyzer, and an electric power source. The water source can be either fresh water or salt water. The electrolyzer is a device that uses electricity to split water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen. The electric power source can be either renewable or non-renewable. There are many different types of electrolyzers available on the market today. Some common types include alkaline electrolyzers, proton exchange membrane electrolyzers, and solid oxide electrolyzers. However, electrolysis of water requires very huge amount of energy which can greenhouse gases. Therefore, to make this process more efficient and eco-friendly different types of green energy sources are used such as solar, wind or hydroelectricity. Solar powered electrolysis is a promising green energy technology that uses sunlight to split water molecules into hydrogen and oxygen. This process can be used to produce green hydrogen gas on a large scale, making it a potential renewable source of energy. Wind power is another renewable energy source that can be used to power electrolyzers. Wind turbines generate electricity, which can then be used to run electrolyzers and produce green hydrogen gas. Hydroelectricity is yet another renewable energy source that can be used for electrolysis. In this process, water is used to turn a turbine, which generates electricity. This electricity can then be used to run electrolyzers and produce green hydrogen gas. Each of these green energy sources has its own advantages and disadvantages. Solar power is renewable and does not produce pollution, but it is intermittent and requires storage. Wind power is also renewable and does not produce pollution, but it is also intermittent and requires storage. Hydroelectricity is renewable, does not produce pollution, and is dispatchable, but it requires a large upfront investment. Storage is an important consideration for green hydrogen production, as green hydrogen gas is often produced intermittently, when the sun is shining or the wind is blowing. Thank you for watching. For more details about electrolysis of green hydrogen click the link below.